Another flight with this red wing, following the latest modifications. I put some, uh, I put some spars underneath it, and uh, a 4S battery, uh, a gyro, and a bigger motor. So, wish me luck. There we go. So, the wind coming in straight from there. So I guess we'll have to launch out into the wind, which is not my favourite way to go. But, that works all right. That was taking off with about 40% throttle. Seems a bit more stable now. Kicking to the left a bit. A ton of power now. A fairly biggish motor for a wing this size. And a 4S battery to kick things along. Probably going to make the ESC get a bit hot. Might be complaining pretty soon, but we'll check it out. So that's that, it seems, okay, ESC, not hot at all, motor, cool, cool, cool. So, since I couldn't do it much in flight, I'm going to give it a few clicks of left. Oh. I trim into the right. It's hanging to the left, so I've got to put a bit more into the left. Maximum trim. Okay. I've got my RC Model Appreciation Society here. Okay, off into that nice little head breeze coming along. Here we go. Dead set rocket ship when you give it enough power on takeoff. It's a pretty mean mover of it. So there's a loop and it's a pretty big one. I've got some bigger throws set up on a switch. I suppose I could switch the higher throws on, but I'm a bit worried because it's touchy enough on the sticks as it is already. If I cut a higher, harder loop than that, I might just break it in half. 
in spite of my new or newly added spars. That's pretty nicely though. Oh, there's a bit of flutter. It can still flutter a little bit in spite of my modification. But early today it was fluttering like crazy without too much, so I had to drive pretty steady. And now we're going a bit better. It's a bit more fun. A bit close to the electric wires. That's probably the best landing I've ever done. Pretty happy with that. <laughs> 